Shannon Smith is probably one of the most courageous people you'll ever meet. Think about all the things you do in one day. Now imagine having to relearn those things, even basic functions. This is what Shannon Smith has to do. I always just say just, just keep you know, motivation and support. I, support is number one. Um, even just standing here like this, even with a walker for someone who's a quadrilateral amputee is amazing. I mean, she's already been standing for, you know, mi minutes on end, and that's, that takes a lot of energy. In December 2010, Shannon was six months pregnant with her second son. She was living in Nevada and was pursuing her dreams as a pharmacy technician. All of a sudden, she started feeling pain. Doctors said she contracted sepsis, a potentially fatal disease that causes the body to react strongly to bacteria. Doctors could not save her son. Um, I I believe he survived for a couple hours, but I went into a coma, so I didn't ever get to uh, meet him or see him or anything. But doctors did save her life by amputating her limbs. Shannon spent nearly a year in a hospital bed. Now her mother says she's lucky to have her by her side. What do you think when you look at her? Um, it's very hard, you know, sometimes to look at your daughter, you know, in this situation, but. No, she's handling it. We are ha uh, handling it. And Shannon does it all with a smile. As she's surrounded by friends and family, watch as she tries to receive a gift. Wait, let's see. Let me see if I can grab it. Okay. This is from Robin and Lola. Shannon says the next things she wants to do is learn how to drive and eventually go to Fiji, an island in the South Pacific Ocean. And here's another thing to add to her list. Shannon plans to finish her studies online. I was in school for pharmacy and working as a pharmacy tech, and I just started that. So I'm going back for that and just, just keeping your goals. And no matter what happens, you can still achieve your goals. What a job.